Yo, 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 what's good, y'all? I got something I need y'all to check out right now. This is crazy. Have you heard of that restaurant that was shut down for serving human meat? What the hell are you talking about? Oh, this will keep you up at night. So in the 1950s, there was a restaurant in Ohio. It was called Cannaburger. For the locals, it was the best burger spot in town. There was always a line going out the door. People would come from around the country to have these burgers. They were the fastest growing restaurant in the country. In 1957, government food inspectors um, inspected the restaurant. Cannaburger appeared to be in compliance with all of the health guidelines, but one of the inspectors just felt something was off. He ended up snooping around the basement and found this bookshelf. He noticed that one of the books was out of place, so he grabbed it. The bookshelf transformed into a door, like something you would see in Scooby-Doo. What he saw behind that door, no one in their right mind could have ever imagined. It was a farm, a farm for human meat. There were multiple vat tanks, cultivating massive amounts of human meat. The cops came immediately and shut it down. They went to arrest the founder and owner of Cannaburger. His name was Dr. Brown, a brilliant scientist and entrepreneur. They surrounded his mansion in California. Out of nowhere, the ceiling of the house transformed and began to open up. Some sort of aircraft flew out. It was like nothing we have ever seen. It is suspected he went to Mexico. Despite a worldwide investigation, Dr. Brown was never seen again. 